Holy moly! Bail! Run away! What is going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Grounded. Uh, we're doing the things. Yes. So last episode, we got uh, we got the floors. We went and t chatted with a robot. We talked to, to talk to them about some things. Anyways, we need to get more science points because we need to unlock more stuff. Um, but we do need to get a base built as well. So I'd like to start off the episode. I want to get the gear. I want to get some uh, some of this stuff. The acorn stuff, because it looks like that's going to increase our maximum health. Oh, it looks like you can kind of mix and match. So this gives us a max health bonus. Uh, this gives us a better stomach bonus. <laughs> and this one gives us more stamina. I don't know. I don't think we can wear. Can we wear them all together? I don't think we can, because that's shin guards, leg plates. We need woven fibers. Acorn chest piece. Okay, so let's start that. Let's start off by getting some armor. Let's armor up and uh, hopefully we can survive a little bit longer and stuff. And we also need to find thistles. I think, I don't know if that's a thistle plant. I don't know why I think that's a thistle plant. It's like a, uh, it's not a thistle plant. It's like a flowering plant, but I think it might have thistles or maybe we can get them from the roses. Oh, those roses are thornless, aren't they? What the heck? <laughs> Where am I supposed to get the stuff? Oh, well, it's fine. Uh, let's harvest up a bunch of these acorns for now and uh get these guys going and hopefully get some gear okay how many acorns do i have i have six in my backpack i need three for that but i need one two three okay so i have all the acorns i need i just need um might fuzz we have that we have that we need woven fiber that's all we need heck yeah that should be easy enough uh let's go ahead and make all of these well okay all both i guess that's to say all both of them <laughs> of course is this this almost looks like clean water, but it's not because it says slurp with a question mark. That doesn't that doesn't instill confidence. All right, let's see what we can get here. Uh, we can get the mask. We can get that. I need. Oh, I need clover leaf. OK, so let's craft one of those. Oh, craft at workbench. Shoot. All right. So I need clover leaf, too. I thought I had everything. Interesting. Oh, it's just barely missing it. OK, you know what? We're going to we're going to recycle it and we're going to remake it. It needs to be right here. Okay, there. We'll try that. I moved it forward a little bit. I think it should be good. Uh, okay, so let me make sure that I didn't just use the stuff that I needed for that. Okay, so we have those. We're good there. Um, Shoot, I need another acorn piece. I used an acorn piece by Don't making that. It. Okay, so hopefully that will catch that. And we'll have like a little infinite water source right there. That'll be super handy. All right, let's go get some more of these acorns. Oh, they're like everywhere. That's wonderful. Uh, okay, so we're hungry. I actually want to see. I can eat these, right? Uh, better than starving, I think. Better than starving, I think. What do you mean? It's like way better. Let's put that on eight. Let's see how those do. Oh, those give us so much more food. Heck yes. Okay, cool, cool. That gives us so much more food than the mushrooms do. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, so we need to go to the workbench in order to craft our gear. Armed raspberry puncho. Interesting. What's up, little ant? You get that guy. You get that guy. You show him who's boss. All right. Let's get uh, acorn face mask. Yep. This. Yep. And then what are we missing here? Uh, oh, I need more woven fiber. And I need more uh, I need more clovers. Okay, clovers right here. So easy enough. And we should be good on the chest plate. Ta-da. All right. So hold on. Let's see what's in my, let's see what's in my inventories. So I should be able to craft... Uh, can you, I like, uh, equip? Okay, acorn face mask, acorn chest plate. Where'd the shin guards go? Right there. Nice. Uh, am I supposed to, uh, like, does this go in here? Oh, shift is to use the dandelion tuft. Nice. Okay, so we've got armor. We have some armor. Wonderful. Now, we got to figure out what I need. I got to figure out where the thistles are. So nat fuzz woven fiber. Okay, so we can take those out um, because I think we're going to need the bows. I would say that's probably our best bet when it comes to when it comes to uh, taking on spiders or anything. It's like you, we're going to need to be from a distance, you know? You know what? We need to make a storage chest as well. That's what we need as well. Uh, let's see. Where's that storage chest? Storage chest. 
Okay, two clovers, four acorn shells, and four sap. That should be easy enough. How's my inventory? My inventory is like super full. Okay, so I should be able to get that. Uh, that's not sap. Darn it. Uh, this guy is bad. Let's go ahead and trash that. We'll go ahead and trash that. And let's see what else we have in here. Okay, we should be able to get stuff. So, I need sap and more acorns. Oh, we can also check on our water storage and see if it's actually collecting the water now. Uh, sap. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed. Are you collecting the water? No, it just rolls right off of it. No water filtration tablets. Oh, uh, it just rolls. Okay, so it, this actually has to be interacted with. I was hoping we could collect it passively, but it does not look like that's an option for us, unfortunately. Okay, I need more sap. Uh, you know what? Let's let's try out the dandelion thing. Let's try it out. It says shift. So we're gonna jump off of here. <gasps> oh, look at that! How cool is that? <laughs> Why is that so cool? I don't know, but I love it. Okay, um, I need more sap. Let's see. You're a sap. Okay, cool. Um, Sap clump? Let's hit it. Let's see what we get out of this thing. How many are we going to get? Oh, wow. It takes a few. There we go. Holy. Oh, I was about to say. I was like, do we seriously get all of that sap? No, of course not. But we got four. That's pretty good. Oh, no. We got more than that because it rolled downhill. Ladybug, you stay away. All right, let's craft up a chest. Uh, we'll leave this at our place. We'll drop some stuff, and then we got to go out and figure out where the thistles see the thistles are. Now, do I need to be by the thing for that clover? Oh shoot, I forgot the clover because it's right here. <laughs> it's like right next to it. I completely forgot about it. Uh, storage chest. Heck yes, that's gonna go up here because we're gonna put it inside of our base. All right, so let's put you. Let's go ahead and put it like right next to the door. I don't know where the front is. Probably this side. All right, we'll put it right there and then let's build it. Oh, look at how much storage there is. Okay, perfect. So let's see. Let's just go ahead and store like everything that we don't need. Well, actually, hold on. What do we need for arrows? Actually, I guess I should go ahead and make a bow. Ooh, nat fuzz. I don't have nat fuzz. So I need, you know what? That stuff we can get anywhere. And then arrows, mite fuzz and this little seed. Okay, so I'll make sure to keep mite fuzz if I have any. What is this? Nat fuzz? Okay, so we'll keep that. We'll keep that. And we'll throw the rest of the stuff into storage. All right, perfect. That looks good. Uh, got the inventory cleaned up all nice and neat. Got my useful tools here. We got some food in here. Um, I put some food away and then we have the mite fuzz and nat fuzz so that way we can make the things as we need to. So we need to figure out where I get thistles from. Let's go check out this plant right here because this kind of looks like it would be a thistle plant, you know? It is a thistle plant. You discovered thistle needle. Oh, we just get thistle needles from hitting it. Does this have like an infinite supply of thistles? I think this has an infinite supply of thistles. Okay, I got 30 thistle needles. <laughs> That's a little bit more than I needed. Okay, that was a thistle plant. That's good. So, mite fuzz. Now we gotta get some mites and we gotta get some gnats. All right, let's go. Let's go on a hunting hunting expedition here, shall we? What is attacking my thing? Hey, what? Why are you stealing out of this? What a jerk. Get out of here, stupid ant. Stupid ant. Okay, so what am I supposed to do with that? I didn't think the ant was going to attack it. We've never had that issue before. Ants have never attacked anything before. So I guess that's got to be up higher. They don't like storage chests, apparently. <laughs> Interesting. <gasps> Were they attacking it because of the food? I almost wonder if they're attacking it just because there's food in there. Okay, so we got ant parts. Uh, we got an ant head. Is there any other food in here? Let's see if we'll stick it good that oozes from roots. Oh, it's combustible. Stick. Okay, it should be good. I can't believe that was being attacked. What the heck? And it was being attacked from the bottom. We need walls. We need walls. Okay. All right, back out to explore. We need gnats and mites. Hello, Mr. Mites. Don't mind me. I just need your fuzz. Is there any more? I also need gnats, too. I'm going to have to try to find some gnats. Oh, wait, hold on. There's like a building here. Oh. <gasps> What is that? Oh, it wants me to build the markers there. That's what it wants me to make at these things. Uh, is that utilities? Trail marker. That's what it needs. Uh, plant fiber and clover leaf. Okay, so it wants me to place one right there. Got it. That's not bad. Let's go take out this mite. Oh, there's a gigantic cockroach right over there. Uh-oh. Oh, it's a stink bug. Oh, there's stink bugs. They're stinking up the place. Oh, man. 
You know, I gotta say, <laughs> these bugs are the worst. Like, you think you don't like them in... Oh. Is that clean water? Don't even need to boil it. Oh, nice. Uh, it's hard... Ooh! Time to go. Time to run. Don't look back. Run. Don't look back. Okay. Oh my gosh. This place is gonna kill me. I don't know where any gnats are. I haven't seen any gnats lately. This is a pretty good little spot for a base, too. It's nice. Cleared out. Not seeing anything crazy going on right here. We're making our way slowly back to my, uh, my initial camp. I'm hoping I can get close enough to get to some of the inventory and hopefully get some of the gnat fuzz because I think I, I think I left the gnat fuzz in there. Yeah, so we have all these little things right here. Where's the giant spider at, though? It's probably right there. Okay, hold on. Let's see. Uh, nope, it's just a ladybug. Okay, so I have some gnat fuzz. Oh, wait. That's my inventory. And then we have mite fuzz. Hey, hey. Oh, there's the gnats. Get back here. Get back here. All right, perfect. So we're good on that. We have the stuff for the bows, we have the stuff for the arrows, and we have another gnat inbound. Okay, you know what? Fine, you stay over there. Let's just head back to our base. It's starting to get dark already, and it's a little scary over here. Man, it took me a lot longer to get back than I thought it would. This, uh, it is easy to get turned around in here. <laughs> you think you're in one area? You're not, you're in a whole different area, it was crazy. Um, okay, it is oh it is now nighttime so we can go ahead and sleep and then we can come back We can make some bows and make some arrows. All right. It is a new day. Let's go ahead And we should be able to craft Tools spring bow. What am I missing woven fiber? Of course, of course, I'm missing woven fiber and one spring bow and a whole lot of arrows. I don't know how many, <laughs> I don't know how many arrows we're gonna need to do everything. <gasps> Thistle needles are gone. Okay, how many arrows do we have now? So we have a spring bow. That's fantastic. Let's go and put it in our inventory now. I'd rather have this instead of the pebble. So let's go ahead and throw that right there. And then, wha bam. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, we can pick up our arrows. <gasps> Wonderful. All right. So we kind of have a mission. Let's get the things we need for the, what is it? What is it? It's utilities. It is the trail marker. Okay. So we need some sprig and some clover. All right. We can handle that because we know where one's at. Um, and there is a bug on it and we're going to try out our fancy new bow and see how it goes. <laughs> see how it goes. So let's hop on over there. Mm. It's worse than dad's Brussels sprouts. It's the it's acorn. It's not that bad. I would imagine acorn would be better than mushrooms. I mean, I maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I can't believe that that thing just rolls right don't out of there like that. Boil it. Jeez. Okay. Um, clover. You're one of the things I need. I really want to get the axe mark too as well. I don't know how we need to do that though. I'm hoping that we get a whole bunch of science points from knocking out these um these little mission deals all right so there's those let's go ahead let's do this oh man let's do this this is gonna be this is gonna be fun uh i'm nervous i'm scared that i'm gonna mess up and get destroyed by this big huge gigantic but hey there's a thistle plant right there wow look at that i was right next to it the whole time and i didn't even realize it okay can we get up here okay so that is the bug that I'm worried about. Should we try taking it out? Let's try it. Let's see what happens. hi -ya! It's a bombarder beetle. Oh, this isn't too bad. It's not bombarding me. Okay, you know what? We're never going to kill this thing. I'm literally never going to kill that thing with these arrows. Like, they do almost no damage. That thing does like next to no damage. Oh, big fight, big fight, big fight. Oh, right in the head. Uh, is it even worth taking this thing out? Probably. Oh, holy moly, Bale, run away. Okay, we need something better than, than these arrows. I have, how many arrows do I have left? I have 21 left. Uh, okay, we need it, we need a better position. You know what? And go ahead and pick up all these arrows though real quick okay 
and we can hop up here real fast maybe no no i'm gonna die i'm dead i'm dead i'm dead i'm dead i'm dead i'm trying no <laughs> it got me oh i should have got off the rock okay respawn oh my gosh we're so far away <laughs> we're so far away um i don't know how much my armor protected me those beetles are like no joke um i feel like i honestly feel like if you are soloing this it's gonna be very hard i feel like it'd be a lot easier because this is a three-person co-op i believe it'd be so much easier with three players because if there's three of us doing that we, we probably could because i think i already did a third damage on it i think we could probably already took it out oh now i have to go all the way back over there i have to grab all my stuff and i hope to i have to hope that I don't die in the process. All right, where's he at? It's over there, okay. Let's grab stuff real quick. Grab, take all. Okay, looks good. Now, how many how many arrows do I have? <laughs> how many arrows do I have? Uh, let's bring this guy out. I have 12 now, wonderful. And I bet you that beetle is fully healed again. I bet you anything it's fully healed again. Maybe not. Where'd he go? Where'd, uh, where'd beetle boy go? Beetle boy, where are you? I don't know where the beetle boy's at. Um, can I go ahead and, well, I can't really craft. Where'd he go? I don't actually know where it went. Oh my gosh, these needle, these, these arrows don't even kill a mite. Oh, come on. Okay, you know what? Let's build this. We've done it. 100 points. 100 points to Gryffindor. <laughs> oh, he's back. No, 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 no. Okay, this way. Okay. Uh, I, I, I built the thing. Okay. Holy moly. How are we supposed to kill that thing? I want to see how much health it has. How much health do you have left, bud? Yep. Fully healed. Okay. Uh, well, we got one. <laughs> we got one. Great Oak Beacon. Oh gosh. What threat is engaging me right now? I'm out. I'm leaving. I don't know what it is. Uh, the Great Oak Beacon. I think that's the one that's inside the Oak tree. Where are the spider's at? A gigantic spider. Oh, man. That did not go well. That did not go well at all. Let me get that water real quick, though. Water filtration tablets needed. Okay, so... Uh, I think that's a ladybug. Okay, where is the... I think the Great Oak Beacon is probably... Right in here would be my guess. It's probably right in here next to the spidery boy. Well, maybe not. I'm not actually seeing it. No, oh, it doesn't look like it's actually there. <gasps> Wait a second. Hold on. What uh, what beacon is that? Wait, so which one is that? Is that the one that I need to go to? Complete marker at Great O Beacon. Isn't that the one I just did? Okay, let's go check this out. Is this, isn't this the one I just placed? Yeah, this is the one I just did. Yeah, I don't know why it wants that one. Okay, so Great Oak Beacon. It's gotta be, it's gotta be the Great Oak, right? Of course. I mean, why wouldn't it be the Great Oak Beacon if it wasn't at the Great Oak? We just gotta figure out where the heck the Great Oak Beacon's actually at. Oh, you know what? I probably should actually have the stuff to actually make the trail marker, huh? Uh, plant fiber. That's easy enough. And we got it. <laughs> right? Yes. Okay, cool. All right, let's see if we can't find this, uh, this beacon that we need to find here. Hmm. Nothing's popping up. Maybe I need to go this way. Oh, are we going to walk across the stick? Heck yes, we are. Heck yes, we are. Um, oh, you know what? Hold on a second. I think I saw some science points up here. <gasps> oh, is that it? That was it. <laughs> awesome. And 100 points. Okay, uh, let's go talk to Roboty, dude. And see if we can get any more missions. This would actually be a cool little place to build a base. I, you probably can't, though. No, it wouldn't be cool. It would take forever to get back and forth to the base. Well, it'd be rather safe, though. Hmm. Interesting. Let's go talk to our uh, little robot friend, shall we? It's the fastest way to our robot friend. I think the robot dude's, like, right up in here, right? Because we're just... <laughs> There's a spider web. Not going that way. There's the actual spider! Oh, God! Okay, there's a lot of webs right there. Yeah, we'll just go around the other way. What do you say? Oh, well, there's, I mean, there's all the, wait, so is this is the pond that my base is built around, though. 
Well, hold on a second. This kind of goes to the water. Is this water clean? I doubt it. You know how cool it'd be if we could build a boat and just like go boating? <laughs> That'd be so much fun. Or if they added like a diving suit or something, you could go underwater and do stuff. <gasps> can we take the can? We got the Calvo can. Yeah, there's a... Uh... I can see my house from here. There's a... Uh... Ooh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. It left me alone. It didn't want any. Oh, there is totally a way to the water right here. I hate the spiders. So I do believe there's actually an arachnophobia mode or they're working on one. Um, I'm actually kind of curious what it would turn the spiders into though. Like would it turn them into like centipedes or something? Cause that'd be even worse. All right, we're just going to go around. Oh, look at these pretty blue flowers. This is a cool air. <laughs> I need to figure out how to properly deal with spiders because like I can't explore anywhere because there's spiders everywhere. <laughs> this is terrifying. Ugh. <gasps> there's a research camp right there. Do you see that? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Field station. You discovered a field station. It's definitely not a naturally occurring structure unless crystals come with computers now. Okay. All right, hold on. Let's jump up here. Let's take a quick peek. Let's make sure spiders are somewhat at bay. Okay, that spider's all the way over there. Uh, any other spiders? I don't see any. Okay, let's check out this field research station right here. Let's see what we got. <gasps> oh, okay. Uh... It's a shame that it's like right here next to the spider area, though. Kind of unfortunate. All right, here we go. Let's go in here. And let's talk to our little robot buddy and see if we have some new missions. I wonder how uh, the cleaning up has gone. Uh, not very well. Not very well at all. What's up, dude? It's nice to see a friendly face around here. Uh, what should I be doing now? Why don't you work on building a bigger base first? It seems like you. Okay, like cool. Builder base. Uh, science questions. I don't have any more questions for you. Any work? Uh, kill soldier ant four. How do I know which ones? The, the wilds have been overrun. Do away this vile plague at once. Hunt and kill four to claim your prize. Oh my gosh. You know how long it's going to take for us to get these points? Uh, okay, so we'll go ahead and accept it. Why not? And then let's see. Oh man, let's see trade wise what we got here. Oh my gosh, two, a thousand, two thousand, five thousand. Oh my goodness. It's gonna take forever to get to five thousand. Uh, an upgrade for the scab, the scab scanner module that allows it to detect nearby raw science. That would be kind of nice because that would help us get more science for everything. Torch plus. Um, oh, okay. A torch that's been approved by the power of science will light your way for a very long time. I wonder if there's going to be a, uh, axe two on here eventually. So like I said, this is, this is early access. So there's not like, you know, there's, there's things that are, that are not here. Uh, I kind of want to see what's down here. Should we explore? Uh, that looks like a one way ticket to death. A one-way ticket to death, indeed. Yeah, that's that's gonna be. <gasps> nope, there's science. Oh, we can swim. I got science. False science. Okay, now how do I get out of here? How does the torch work underwater? Oh, jeez. Oh no, no, no! Don't tell me I have to go out through the. Oh, do I really have to go out through the cavey thing where the spider's at? No, I'm going to die. Oh, I didn't want to come down here. Why did I come down here? Uh, <gasps> that's a soldier ant. That's what it was talking about that I need to kill. Okay, hold on. Holy moly. Those things are not going to be nice. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't have come down here. I made a mistake. Okay. Oh, wait, can we get back out right here? Oh, I think we can. Oh! Yeah, we totally can. We should be able to. Uh, okay, so that's where the soldier ants are. I don't have enough arrows to take them out right now, so I'm not even gonna try. But I do kind of want to peek around and see what's, see what's going on here. Man, I would love to see this place, like, fixed up again, you know? I think it's gonna be cool if they, if they do that. I also want... I'm also curious if there's more science things. 
that we can unlock more recipes with the um with this robot guy but i don't i don't see any laying around here hmm what are you doing get out of here get out of here weevil aha you're gone you're done son okay i'm looking to see if there's like any other little hidden hidden bits and bobs around here doesn't really look like it i'm curious to see what ha what happened to everything like where's the uh where's the person in charge all right i don't see anything else here i can't get through here it looks like oh it's glass it's just really clean okay i don't see anything else really down here whatsoever okay back at the safety of our rocks <laughs> the safety of our rocks <laughs> they're not even that safe so i'm kind of curious because we have a few missions here and there and we have some science stuff that we can unlock but i'm curious if there's like what else we have left to do because i feel like i feel like there should be a like i feel like this stuff right here should open up uh map wise we haven't opened that up yet and i'm actually kind of curious because uh well how big is this map you know is there well i guess we were over there we kind of stopped right there hmm curious very curious um what there's a mushroom garden how did i miss that a small patch of dirt that that produces edible mushrooms a few times a day <gasps> we need to make a whole bunch of those those are super cool and then we have a smoothie station mixes and blends things into a drinkable substance that restores health and provides various side effects um art stuffed weevil stuffed mite stuffed gnat uh meal prep utilities okay so we got the the pounce stuff those those a sap catcher attached to sap producing roots and branches for more convenient harvesting <gasps> oh there's ant stuff too wait is this hold on is this better than no the acorn stuff looks like it's better but Ooh, that gives us hauling strength plus hauling strength. So that means that we would be able to acid gland. Oh, that's got to be from the ants or from one of that's. Oh, I wonder if that beetle is what drops acid glands. That would make. I wonder if that increases how many uh, things we can haul at one time. That'd be kind of cool. That's actually neat that the ant armor gives you more strength like that. That's kind of cool. I like that. I like that. I'm just kind of going through looking at stuff uh used to dig up grubs oh that's what those are the things we see run around all the time all right cool so i guess really oh my gosh i just realized that that is an ant head i just realized that that's so funny um so really our next kind of thing is i'd like to get some more base building done to be honest now i would like to do these sturdy things but those weed stems are so far away so i think we're gonna stick with grass for now um and then let's go ahead and put up some walls actually let's do a couple windows first and then we'll go ahead and put up some actual walls all right so we'll throw a window there i guess do i want windows on all of them hmm probably not all of them we'll throw windows on some of them though okay so we'll throw windows there and then we'll do regular walls and then we gotta do a doorway as well okay so there's all the windows and the walls uh, we need a lot of grass. I kind of wish there was like some kind of wheelbarrow or a cart. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm thirsty. Uh, let's go see if there's any water left over here. Ooh, it's nighttime. It's sleepy time. Is there any water? Hmm. Not seeing any. We'll probably be fine till the morning, right? Maybe? And another beautiful morning. Okay, so we got these laid out. Uh, we need to get a door in here as well. But yeah, it'd be nice if there was like some kind of cart or something that would allow us to uh to move a, a few more items i guess maybe that's where the armor comes into play though huh hmm that that's that armor would be really nice but i think we have to take out the soldiers and i just don't think we have the weaponry to do it i mean i guess we could i could just make a whole bunch uh whole bunch of arrows go down we could try to kill all those all those ants a lure arrow might not be too bad as well. Interesting. We got so much stuff to do. Oh, uh, we got to get our base built for sure, though. And I'd like to expand it, too. I'd like to have a bigger base, you know? Oh, we got all kinds of things. So uh, that's going to end this episode.
Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like if you're new here. Don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. So I think what I might do for some of the base building stuff is we might actually do a live stream because uh, it's going to be pretty grindy. So if you guys want to catch a live stream, twitch.tv slash Um, I'll have a link down below over on Twitch. You guys can head over there. We might do a live stream over there. We might do one on YouTube, but I would follow on Twitch just in case. But um, I think we'll I think we'll go ahead and live stream the actual like base building part because that's going to take forever to grab all the stuff and do all the things. Um, and then maybe, hmm. I'm almost thinking maybe we need to bring Miss Z in here. <laughs> that would be pretty fun. And she might she might actually be able to help us out with taking out some of those bigger bugs too, because like solo. I mean, I put well, I mean, I guess I didn't put that many arrows. I put like 30, but it was I mean I died. And I probably would have got like half health. So I don't know. We'll have to we're gonna have to mess with that. We're gonna have to make a whole bunch of arrows and do the things, and we're just gonna have to try. We're gonna have to try stuff. I'm super excited. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one.